What's up guys, Bearded here, and uh, welcome to, I guess, the first video that I'm doing, I guess. <laughs> I don't, I, I, I wanted to do this, and now that I'm doing it, I just, I don't know what to say. Uh, this is kind of going to be the format of my vlogs for now. I, I apologize if you hear wind, I don't know how well the, this uh, headset uh, holds against, uh, well, wind. The camera mic itself isn't the best, and I, I apologize if I'm too close, I'm trying to hold it far away. I almost, I'd almost need one of them boom sticks to either hold this or just get some sort of prop, uh, prop it up somehow on my tripod and um, just kind of do it that way. I actually like how crisp and clear this camera records. It, sorry, my hand's in the way. It needs the proper lighting though, like, um, if it doesn't have the proper lighting, it just gets all grainy and it kind of looks like shit. And sometimes, like, even holding it right now, I'm kind of shaking. And that probably is a bit annoying to some people. So I'd probably, I'd, I gotta find something to hold it still. But um, in the future, I do plan on buying, um, uh, what's it called, a DSLR camera or whatever. Or just uh, kind of like one of them Canon or... Uh, Nikon cameras, they're like big and bulky and they got a mic on the top with the uh, wind break. I don't know if it's called a windbreaker, but it's like a big wool cover on the mic. But anyways, um, yeah, so this is the start of a new series. I know I've done vlogs before, but this is going to be the first episode of um, the adventures with Bearded Kitty or the adventures of Bearded Kitty. Um, I can't quite remember the title in my head, but I have it written down. And I kind of want to keep doing this, uh, whether it's uh, whether it's with the cat, whether I'm out and about, whether it's just an update. I want to do it in this fashion. And uh, I know not everybody likes time lapses, but I actually do. I like playing with them in editing, and I like uh, seeing the uh, how something that's either moving slow or something that's moving fast. Uh, can be changed and altered to make it look so much better. Um, uh, so much better and uh, it really captures um, the beauty of it, I guess, is one way of putting it. So yeah, I will be uploading vlogs every Sunday, so it's once a week. Uh, same thing with uh, uh, gaming videos. I think for now, ARC is going to be like kind of my main focus, but that is going to be every Wednesday, I think, so like the middle of the week. Um, if you're wondering why I'm inside now, that is because uh, as I was recording, uh, some dark clouds started coming overhead. I think it's a pop-up thunderstorm because uh, as I was checking something, sorry, I'm close. Um, as I was checking something, it started to rain. And then right as I thought, I should go inside, there was some thunder. And I thought, yeah, I should really go inside. <laughs> Raining sideways. Yeah, so that's kind of where I'm at right now. Uh, all I am focusing on is vlog sun every Sunday, arc every Wednesday, and I think live streams. I'm going to continue doing Monday, Wednesday, Friday because that seems to roughly follow what you guys want. Because uh, if you guys remember, um, at the beginning of the the month or beginning of the month, last month anyway, like like even over a month ago. I created a uh, viewer feedback uh, poll with Google Forms, and I, I, I think I tagged it in the description of a video, and I tagged it in my Discord, and you guys responded to my questions. The other thing that I'm going to talk about is this freaking heat. Uh, it's just so fucking hot. Like, <laughs> I, I'm, I'm actually trying to swear less in my videos because of how things are, but at the same time. I'm gonna quickly mention, because videos, 
Um, I'm going to quickly mention that I am no longer going to monetize my videos just because of all the trouble that YouTubers are getting into with monetization and, um, but at the same time, like, they're way bigger than I am. I mean, like, I don't, I'm not saying that I'm not happy with that. I'm just saying they actually have a foot in the door, I guess, with YouTube. Like, they can actually make, they can actually live off of it. They can actually make a decent income from the videos they make. And that's fine, but I'm just not at that point. So, why bother going through that shit? Like... Why, why bother have the monetization activated if I barely make a cent per video and then feel bad because it got demonetized because either some per, excuse me, some person decided to, uh, copyright their, their music, which used to be royalty free or copyright free. Um, and that's why I use it. I, I actually do my, I actually do my research. I make sure that they are providing uh, free to use music um, and I actually sometimes if I'm unsure uh, because I've never heard of the producer or whatever I'll actually search on the YouTube music list and make sure that it isn't copyrighted uh, I'm still going like I'm still going to be careful of that stuff but occasionally like especially at the point I am now I might just use something that's copyrighted and if they say oh well that's ours fine like if you want to put ads on my video fine but there's no point for me to do it myself I've had some people say it might bite me in the ass in the end but the way I see it uh, if I don't monetize my videos they can't exactly scold me for it because I'm not claiming it's mine and I always give credit I always I don't, I never say, oh, I made this song or this belongs to me. I just use it and I'll, I'll credit the person in the description or even in the video. I, I kind of want to start doing that, just putting up uh, some text and saying, this is the song, it was made by this person. And maybe like, oh, check them out at their Twitter or something. But um, anyways, I kind of went off track there. I, I wanted to talk about heat and I started going on about copyright. But I, I'm just saying, that's kind of how I want to go with that. But anyways, it is freaking hot. Like, it is so hot, everything feels wet. Not It's not just hot. Like, like it's the temperatures for the following, or for this week and the following week, it's like in the high 20s and sometimes even in the low 30s. Like, I, I can deal with that. That's, like, some people go, oh, that's normal, whatever. But it's the Humidex. If you don't know what the Humidex is, it's the, uh, it's the meter for the humidity in the air. And it is so high that they were even, pr they were even saying that they wouldn't be surprised if it reached 100%. But my dad was saying, if it's 100%, wouldn't that mean it's just raining? But it, it kind of makes sense, but... I'm just saying the Humidex is high, so not only is it hot, everything feels wet, so it makes it even worse, and then because everything feels wet, you you feel sweaty, and then, uh, then after a while, towards the end of the day, you are sweaty, and it's like, I'm taking two showers a day, I'm changing my clothes two times a day, it's like we can barely keep up with laundry, but um, it's all because we're no, like, I'm in Nova Scotia, right? Nova Scotia, Canada, and then south of us, is the Bermuda High. Now, if the Bermuda High is down here, and we're up here, and then I guess there was a, a, a low, a, a low, a strong low pressure system came up behind it, it pushed the Bermuda High up and kind of overlapping, just barely overlapping the, the, the southern tail of Nova Scotia. I guess it stalled because of the, the low, both those systems stalled where they were after they moved and so we literally had what was it it's it's been like a month of a uh, heat wave and it's lasted so long that the low behind the bermuda high uh has actually disintegrated or dissipated i guess is the proper word to say basically the Berm bermuda high is going to pull back and uh probably within the next couple weeks and it might come back up and just cause a few more heat waves but as far as I know 
Holy fuck, it is raining so hard. One thing I hate about glasses, when I'm trying to film myself, I like I, I like to have them so I can see better, because I tend to, to squint when I don't have them on. And uh, what what I hate about the glasses is it really shows a reflection, mainly from the phone itself. I think. No, it's it's from like any light, but it just it's I hate it. I just want it to go away. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this uh, first episode of uh, The Adventures with Bearded Kitty. I, I look forward to doing more vlogs. I'm going to be going to like local events, um, capturing nature, like the, the fog likes to seep in at the end here a lot. I would like to, um, I won't do it all the time, but it's just I'd like to go and capture different uh, times that the fog's in, different settings. There's the local rally as well which i want to attend and get some footage of that so uh yeah we're gonna see how that goes and i still need to find myself a qa testing job i'm done college i'm done the uh internship which is nice uh all that's left now is to start applying for jobs and just kind of see where that goes i hope i find a good one but i i have some places where i want to look but I just, I just hope it goes well because I know how hard these things can be. Anyways, guys, uh, I've been trying to say bye for a really long time now, and I don't know how I'm going to edit this. But anyways, as always, guys, bye from my hands up here. Bye from meow. God, I hate this freaking cat. Ah!